Howdy, this is Edward from Valarm. In this video, you'll see an overview of the quick stats function from tools.valarm.net. This will give you a glimpse of how to perform industrial IoT sensor analytics on Valarm Tools Cloud. Remember to click the subscribe button down below to subscribe to our YouTube channel and help the YouTube algorithm. You your teams, and your organization can monitor and manage your remote monitoring systems with tools.alarm.net. To get started with quick stats, make sure you're looking at your device manager after you log in to your Alarm Tools Cloud account. Click the name of your device you'd like to use for seeing what quick stats does for you. On your device details page, you'll see a button called Quick Stats on the left side under Tools. The red arrow in this video is pointing right to where you'll click. Make sure you've set up custom column names and sensor field aliases. If you haven't already done this, then check out our blog post on Valarm.net that'll show you just how to do that. After you click your Quick Stats button, you'll see, that's right, you probably guessed correctly, you'll now see we have a rundown of statistics for your device. This includes a breakdown of each sensor variable for your device. For example, water levels, temperature, and water quality. You'll see the current time range you're looking at, when the first and last IoT sensor events are, and you'll see the maximum minimum, average, and standard deviation for each of your sensor field measurements. Voila, you've seen magic happen. That's your overview of your quick stats feature on Valarm Tools. This gives you an easy way to get a feel for what's going on with your IoT sensor devices and monitoring equipment out in the field. If you've got any questions, then don't hesitate to get in touch with me at info at .net. Our customers use tools.valarm.net to monitor anything, anywhere. Whether you need to monitor flood warning systems, air quality, water wells, flow meters, smart cities, water quality, or anything else, we're here to help you, your teams, and your organization save your time and save your money. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to click the subscribe button down below to get the latest info on monitoring industrial IoT sensors.